Here's a quick tutorial on how to make Star Wars chocolates and they can also be used as cupcake toppers. So I ordered this ice cube mold from Amazon. It's a silicone mold and then at the craft store I picked up some Wilton candy melts in white and black. And you just want to follow the instructions when melting those on the bag. I just do like 30 second increments and keep stirring it until it's fully melted. Now I took a toothpick and I dipped it in the black chocolate and I just kind of filled in where the eyes would go, the mouth, and then the bottom part of the mask. You just need a very thin layer, just enough to put color there because the rest of it's going to be white. And it does dry pretty quickly. You're going to want to make sure it's completely dry before you put the white in there. The Darth Vader ones are super easy. You just dump the black chocolate in there. I only filled them up about halfway because I didn't want the chocolates to be so thick that they were hard to bite into. So here I am filling up the little Darth Vader's. I keep moving the spoon around. Um, I eventually switched to a toothpick for this as well and just kind of swirled it around to make sure it got in all the crevices. And then when you're done with that, you're going to follow the process for melting the white chocolates and the microwave. And then by that time, the black should be set, so I'm just going to pour in the white chocolate. And same thing, you're just going to want to swirl around gently to make sure it gets in all the little crevices. Then when you're done with that, you pop it in the freezer for about 10 to 15 minutes. You're going to wait, make sure that they're solid, doesn't take long. And then when I took it out, I kind of stretched out the mold just a little bit to kind of help release the chocolate from the sides of it. And then they do pop out pretty easily. And because they're kind of thick, none of them broke, so that was a good thing. So here's what the Darth Vader's look like. Very cute. And the little stormtroopers. I think these turned out pretty good. And then they can be used just as chocolates or you can put them on a cake or on cupcakes which is what I ended up doing. I had a few extras so I laid them out so that people could eat them at the party and then the rest I put on cupcakes. And here's what they look like. I had little Star Wars cupcake liners that I ordered from Amazon. And then I also made a Darth Vader cake using the Wilton cake pan. I do have a video for that. I will link below. So thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.